this is Jason with Dave's Computer Tips with another how-to video for you. This one's on how to create a GIF on your Samsung phone. That's right, you can actually create GIFs with your camera app on your Samsung phone. I'm using the Samsung Galaxy A20. I've tried this on an A10e and I've tried it on A21. So hopefully it's going to work on yours if you have a Samsung Galaxy or a different type of Samsung. So I'm going to show you how to do that right now. So first thing we want to do, obviously you turn on your Android phone. Then go down to the camera app at the bottom and tap on the image, which is the bottom left on mine. All right, so now we're in the camera. Okay, so now you want to be on photo. That's where we're going to be, so make sure you're on that photo tab there. And then when you're there, you're going to hold your... So you can take the camera and aim it at whatever you want and then move the camera while you're doing this. But I'm just going to do it, for the example, laying on my desk. And then I'll bring my head in back and forth and wiggle it around so you guys can see. So what you do is you're going to hold the white shutter, uh, basically the camera punt button when you're taking pictures that one right there you're going to hold your finger down on it and it's going to take pictures as long as your finger is holding down so let's do that and we're going to do this hold your finger down so it's taking pictures i'm do 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 and then let go when you're done it's going to take those images and put them all together and what you want to do next is go over to your um, images so your gallery so you want to tap on the circle on the left hand side with your picture on it and then when you go in it's going to show you a bunch of pictures that you've taken. You've taken 15, so it shows you how many you've taken. So if you scroll over, you can see them all. So I'm going go all the way to the beginning. There I am. That's the very first one. Now each one you can edit from here. So if you needed to do something with it, you wanted to add uh, a, a sticker or you wanted to adjust the coloring, you can do that all right here. So we're just going to choose, let's say this one. And so we're going to choose this one. And then we're going to hit, we're going to tap on the edit pencil. So we're going to hit edit. So this is the example I'm going to show you in this video. There's a lot of stuff you can do with this. So have fun with this. So this is cropping. So you can crop it by grabbing the corners of your finger and dragging this. I don't want to crop it. I'm going to leave it as it is. Um, but I'm going to go to the next one. So the first one's cropping. The next one is basically filters. The, the coloring, warm, cool, all that. You can go through here and change that for that picture. You're going to tap on this one. This one gives you brightness and all those other contrast stuff, and the and which is really nice to use if you want to change it up. So you can really get in here and get crazy with it. Um, and then if you go back on the pencil end, we'll go to back to the sticker in a minute, but let's hit the pencil on the end here. And if you hit the pencil, it gives you a drawing tool. So this is kind of fun. So right now we're just going to draw something on there. But we do 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 do. I can't. I'm doing this with not watching really. So a, a weird smiley face. So you can do that, or you can just erase it. If you don't like it, hit the eraser, and you go. Oh, I don't want that anymore. So you're going to erase it. You can also make it away go away quicker by just hitting the back, and back, and back, and back, and back. Okay, I didn't realize I had. To. Okay, there. Now it's gone. So you can you can draw pictures on it. You can mess with it that way. So that's kind of fun too. So you might want to test that out a little bit. Also, the one I like to show you, which I showed in my article I wrote, and actually, before why we're in the middle of this, make sure you hit the like and subscribe. Uh, it really helps out our channel a lot, and we really appreciate it. Okay, so back to this. So we're going to hit the sticker, the little sticker button. There we go. And now the stickers are fun, because you can add cool stickers. So down here, they give you a list of types of stickers you can do. So we're going to tap on this little guy, which gives you a whole bunch of different ones. And you can pick one you like. So I'm going to put fiery. There it is. I got it. Now I put up here. Now it's on the screen. So if this, so this gives you a couple options. You can grab the corners to make it bigger or smaller. So if we grab, you know, we tap on it, and we're gonna make it bigger. Hang on, I got it. Come on back here. It's hard to do when you're not looking. So like you can twist it. If you hold your finger there and turn it around, all that stuff, you can move it the way you want. Those are fiery eyes, obviously. You can actually remove it by hitting the. There's a minus sign right up here in the corner. You can do so if you want to get rid of it. You also can hold your finger down on it and drag it to wherever you want to put it. So and I'll put it over my head and you can do that. So that's kind of fun. And then if you like what you did, which <laughs> of course I do, you can hit add sticker. So if you tap, so you can mess with that, you know, remove it if you want, but you can tap sticker. Now the sticker is no add sticker. That's not what I meant to do. It's already added. So what you want to do is you go up to the top and hit save, or you can revert back to normal. That's basically undoing it. Let's save it. So we're going to click save. Ah, uh, now that is on there, but it's only under that one. If you didn't notice that, I don't. It does that all the time. You can actually go back and then go back here, and it's still the right side. It will flip it. I have no idea why it does that. So you're going to do this. It shows you have 15 pictures. You can go through each picture. You can add that same image on every one if you like. You can change a filter on each one. But once you're done with your project, you know you're like, I like what I've done. I've done all the editing. You can share it from here. You can trash it if you don't like the thing. All that. 
But what we want to do is turn into a GIF now, and that's what the main thing about this um, video is. So we're going to go down to the three dots. So we're going to tap on three dots. And there it is right there, GIF, turn into a GIF. So we're going to tap on GIF, and it's going to process it. It's going to go... Okay, so now you can see they just give you an example, which is really nice to have, so you're trying to figure it out. So that is how you... About now, now since we're done, go to the top. We can either share it or we can save it. You can share it. I'm going to tap on that and see what it does. It's going to give me some options. It now saved it saved in my internal storage. So you can go in here and pick, you know, wherever you want to save it. Go down here. You can pick Facebook feed or whatever like that. If you don't want to do that, it should be saved to your gift place. So let's check that real quick. Okay, so when we hit share, it automatically saved it to your um, device. So if you want to go find it in, a, in the device spot, so you're going to go back down here. You're going to hit the middle home button right down here. I usually do that. And then if you want to go to your gallery, so my gallery is down here, there's gallery, and there it is right there. Your gift is saved in here, so if you go in here, that's your gift. As you can see, it keeps having the flames come on my head. Now you can actually save it in an email, text, or send it to an email and text like that, and you can share it with everybody. But that's how you actually make a GIF on your Samsung phone. There's a lot of options to mess with when you're doing this, so go ahead and mess with it. But this is really cool, so now get out there, start creating cool GIFs, and start sharing them. Make sure to check out davescomputertips.com uh, where all, all our articles are and make sure to subscribe to this channel. And thanks for watching.